Oh, they said they never showed William's wife? No, they showed her. They showed his wife. That's what they did. I'm like, so nigga, they did show her. I, I was talking about Wesker's wife. Oh. We never seen Wesker's quote unquote wife. Where's this movie? This and update this. Update this. They were playing Miss Claire Rip. You can take the control and start playing, dude. Original, right? Yeah. Oh, perfect dirt. <laughs> I forgot. On this, we actually have to be going to the thing with Bobby the Blue and about speed of box. Now you can press save thing. Fighting foes is not the only way to survive this horror. So you run? Maybe. Resident Evil. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. Called the Raccoon City. It was later revealed that the terrible disaster had been caused by the T virus. A mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated for use in bio experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department's special stars immediately began investigating. Oh shit, that's right. Watch Dogs 2 is going to get announced. Thanks to the efforts of I mean, you guys excited about Watch Dogs 2 and Jill Valentine. Hey. But the Umbrella Corporation. Watch Dogs 1. It was good. Far. Could have been way fucking bad. But it, yeah, I think everyone is this. I think that's how everyone feels about. Uh, oh shit, this is still fucked up. Sorry if we give you guys epilepsy. Wait. I'm just gonna cut it. I'm sorry. Yeah, we can just skip those cutscenes. It's not like they really matter. I gotta fucking figure out how to fix that shit. Because the last thing we need to see is an invisible tyrant again. That's the last thing we need to see. You guys that up. Classic boys. <laughs> welcome. <laughs> welcome to the chain. Welcome back, man. Welcome to the chain grabs. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> what a way to start off Resident Evil 2 chain grab, boys. Now you're hurt. Oh, man. You're going to die before we even start the game fully. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. What is that? <laughs> Run, run, run! <laughs> Bro, I had a feeling that shit was gonna happen. Yo, the chain grass was ridiculous. Ain't no healing items. <laughs> Freeze! Who are you? What are you doing? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Don't shoot! I'm a human. They promised awesome graphics. I mean, like, what do you expect though? It's Ubisoft. Like, Ooh. come on. They kind of know for downgrading the games babe. after showing it the first few times. I thought you were one of them. But like everything else about Watch Dogs What's is going pretty, on in this town? pretty damn cool. Hold on. I ain't got no clue, darling. Notice how he locks By the door. By the time I noticed something was wrong, <laughs> the entire city was like, infested with zombies. He only locks the door. Doesn't put any barricades on the windows. Like thinking back on thinking back on this, he deserved to die. <laughs> He deserved it. He deserved to die. God damn died. it, Claire. <laughs> Take control, boys. How do I control it? You can't. It controls you. But it looked like Resident Evil 2, which you played. Nah. Nah. It, uh, it doesn't look that bad. I can't wait to the fucking updated version. It's downgraded for sure, but it doesn't look that bad. But, like, it could have been so much better than what it actually turned out to be. So you're gonna play uh, you're gonna play the, the risk game and try to pick up the crossbow. Yeah. He's still got to hey, hey. Want somebody to come in. I mean they they came in alright. Uh, he definitely came in alright. Uh, Wait, is this actually lobby that was? Hold on. Oh, boy. Oh, 
Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> hey, glow gun boys. You should be able to make it fast. I mean, look how slow they are. Hey, bye! <laughs> See you guys later. Yo, the chain grabs was OD though. The chain grabs was so OD. That shit was like top tier as all fuck. Lawbreakers is out? I mean, the stuff is out? But yeah, that that chain grab was probably like the best part, man. It's like you immediately come to the game, and that's the first thing that happens. It's kind of like it's kind of like the game been watching us play fucking Resident Evil. And it was like, you, guys, fucking thing. you guys had it way too fucking easy. Way too easy. It's time to kick it up a notch. You're going to enter this game, and the first thing that's happening to you is you're going to get chain grabbed right off the jump. And boy, did they not meet, did they not miss a beat at all. I could easily fucking restart this, but... Ain't no restarting. We real men. We don't restart our games. We got this. Not like, not like it's a big old problem, problem. You know what I'm saying? If you had, matter of fact, you can just knife these bitches. I wouldn't do it because you ain't got no help. What? <laughs> she's not down for the count, but she's down for right now. Go, Red. Go. Oh, oh, oh. Yo, the chain grabs. Welcome back to Resident Evil 2. <laughs> Welcome back to Resident Evil 2. That's a great fucking welcome. Resident the good old days. The good old days. <laughs> Happens to the best of <clears throat> them. You can skip all these cutscenes now. Because <laughs> you already kicked the bucket. By the way, uh huh, we're listening. We're listening. You know, I actually have. I actually have this on PS3. Now that I think about it. Oh boy, here we go. Boy, oh boy, boy. You want to talk about getting lucky? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. By the way, horror is not dead. Shit! We're not scared because we're going up. And in the 20th century. They were more scary. Mm. I can I can agree with that. I can definitely agree with that because I I kind of feel like that's that's the reason why I'm not terrified or you know scared of them anymore. Maybe because I've been playing. I was playing this when I was little. I was playing shit like this when I was little. And I was watching Chucky and and Jason and Don't Freddy Krueger and all this I'm other human. shit. <laughs> it's kind of like yeah yeah it's, it's expected. Whew. Sorry about that, babe. I thought you were one of them. What's oh, going on in bitch. this town? Hold on. So, I ain't got no clue. We just yeah, have that problem. I try my notice on because we have serial killers and shit after was infested after with zombies. Movie, you was thinking it could happen to you. Yeah. And that was kind of like It's like whatever. <laughs> Ted Bundy could knock knock your door and eat your genitals. Sounds a little uncomfortable. It's like you may always think about getting hit, but you you may not ever think about that happening to you. You know, like could you could you ever imagine that happening to you? Like you're getting hit from like this fine girl, and then. 
Like, what type, what type of happy ending is that? <laughs> That's some bullshit. That's what's happening. It's the unhappy ending. That's some bullshit. It's a setup. The setup is what it is. Kill all zombies. Oh yeah, that's right. I gotta send you the uh, those links. It'll probably be like a couple. I mean, I wish I could have probably more than half. Like, you had parts. But, uh, man, Ted Bundy just like knock, knocking on your door. And it's just like, does he knock you out first before he just start eating your genitals? Or does he just like unzip you and just goes ham with your genitals? Like, how, does it, how does that work out in that situation? Like, do you just open the door like naked with a towel on? Now he busts in while you try to shower. <laughs> it's like breaking and entering. I mean, we live in a white neighborhood. They call the police in a heartbeat, man. Like our neighbors, like against call, us, motherfucking not the person that's trying to kill. Us. I mean, yeah, sure they're getting confused. They're like, oh, oh, it's two black guys in the house, and, and the white guys just came home. And something's going on. You gotta get here fast. But they'll get here faster because they said the white guys just came home. <laughs> Fuck a sound just went down. Nowadays, you can see blood baths on the street every day because of cartels, huh? What happened? The fucking sound just went down. Ah. When I was shooting. Oh. <laughs> hey, what happened to dude that was with Claire and uh, Cole Veronica? Steve? Yeah. He died. Oh, shit. <laughs> he died, he got infected, and uh, Wesker took his body. No words what happened to him after that. Though. A lot of people kind of speculate that it was the the use tank in Resident Evil 6, but there's no confirmation on that. There's no confirmation on whatever happened to him after this. He was just a test subject for Wesker. That's all we know. Because he never surfaced. <clears throat> Would be nice to see that happen, but you know. Oh! You guys ready for Resident Evil 2 remake? Fuck yeah! So I've been waiting for this for like the tank controls ever again. I've been waiting for this since the first remake that they did for Resident Evil. I've been waiting for it for that long, so you already know what I'm ready for it. Especially when Resident Evil 3 happened. Mmm, that's gonna be delicious. I just hope Capcom doesn't fuck up and do like another another remastering of a game instead of like a remake of a game. You know, like Code Veronica. Because they thought just doing an HD remaster for that instead of like an actual remake with better controls and stuff was a bad idea at the time. Which is kind of confusing. It's like, why wouldn't you guys want that? Why wouldn't you guys want to, like, make the game even better than what it was before? But, hey. You know, I don't work at Capcom. I don't make the executive decisions. Because if I did, I would have fired Inafune a long-ass time ago. Let's start there. Dollstark is with it. Oh, oh, oh. Hurry up, Red. You gotta go. You gotta, you definitely gotta get the fuck up out of there now. <laughs> um... <clears throat> I would have fired Inafune a long time ago. The Rival Schools, the Dollstalkers, Street Fighter, all those games would have been continuing out of the 90s and early 2000s. Marvel 4 would have happened already. Matter of fact, the patch for Ultimate Marvel 3 would have been happening. If I was an executive over there, I would have been making plays and making moves. I would have been making so many moves that they would fire me for making too many smart decisions. Damn, you was in a straight up danger. Danger, danger. And that's not gonna help too much. So, yeah. Resident Evil Cold Veronica would have got a remake instead of an HD remaster. <clears throat> Resident Evil 2 would have been got a remake. Matter of fact, Resident Evil 1 
through four, no, actually, Resident Evil One through Call of Veronica would have had an HD remake. All right, Outbreak Foul Three would have been happened because Lord knows it's been forty years since then. Monster Hunter would have been on PlayStation again and Nintendo consoles. Capcom fighting All Stars would have happened, aka Capcom versus Capcom would have happened. <laughs> and then, Lawrence oh, Fishburne. Hang in there. And are then, the I would have made them the take building? more time on Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Who are you? Claire, yeah, the fuck are you? I would have been making moves. I'm looking for my brother Chris. Hey, bro, can you give me a we lost before? contact with him over ten days ago. Chris, I got you, so Jill good. Barry. Thank you. Every last Stars team member has disappeared. But that's just me. Listened. I would have been making those type of moves, and everybody would have been happy. Capcom wouldn't be in the situation that they're in now, ago, which probably still would have happened. Incident involving these yeah, that zombie two months ago. creatures that in a mansion ago. located in the outskirts. Well, while he's trying to take over Capcom, I'm gonna take over uh, Chris and Rockstar. the other stars members. Alright, so they can fuck up more stuff? Nah, no, we need some more one fucking good race again. Oh, shit, that was fast. Yeah, Thank you. Like, at the risk of yeah, their own lives. It would be nice lives. to get, like, another, um... But no Because when I found out leave that the... Midnight Club got canceled, uh, I was pissed. Yeah. Are you okay? Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. <laughs> there aren't any survivors in the... Left out Mega Man? Man? Yo, no. You, you should be able to unlock the doors in the hall Thank with you. this. Now go. But See, I would have left out Mega Man. Go. Bitch, go! Because I would have fired Inafune. Okay. Just hang in there. I'll be yeah, back soon. he would have really went to uh, beat Mighty Number no. Nine. Like I would have got rid of Inafune because Inafune is not a he's not a producer. He's not a director. He's a businessman, and no one seems to really understand it about him. This cop Marvin doesn't sound black. What? How the fuck do you sound black? I don't fuck with Are you talking about fake ass Lawrence Fishburne? I'm still trying to figure out like how do you sound black? I guess you gotta say yo no yo 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 yo, yo nigga. You, you got how you sound white? Like dude, that's totally awesome. Side it. That's like totally awesome, dude. <laughs> also Midnight Club 24 7 on my PS2. Yeah, Midnight Club was was sick. And then we had Burnout, and then we had Gran Turismo, and then later down the line we had Forza. If we had our Need for Speed. And then we had, oh yeah, we did have Need for Speed. Yeah. But they was, Midnight Club and Need for Speed kept competing for each other. Yeah, that happened. And then I don't know what happened after that. Midnight no, uh, Need for Speed bought, uh, well, right, basically Brown Cow. Why the fuck am I saying Cow Cow? You okay there? No. <laughs> Like I'm over here feeling fucking horrible and I'm fucking fighting zombies and Wesker. So like, Love, did you explain like how do you sound black though? Cause I'm like, I'm actually kind of confused. Because I didn't know that you could sound... A color? A color? <laughs> Where is... No, 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 it's like, it's not racist. I don't think that's racist, but I'm like, I never understood like that in general. That's what I mean. So... Sorry to imply that it was like a racist thing because it obviously wasn't. Like, if it was a racist thing, you would have did like, you know, you would have actually said something that's like racist. You know what I'm saying? That was like, oh my god, he's racist! I gotta ban him. But it's like I'm more confused on like when people say, "I'm fine, bitch," that someone doesn't sound like black. What or, the fuck is that? Or they don't sound white, or they don't sound Asian, or they don't sound, you know, like. How the fuck you? I'm so fucking sorry. Congratulations, Fred. <laughs> they cool? Yeah. I mean, this shit already happened. Uh, my bad. So it will probably be in your best interest to make sure that it doesn't happen again to make it worse. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, the court. Yeah, yeah. So that's that's kind of what I mean by that. It's like, that's what I mean by I'm confused. Y'all want to see some sick shit? How you can sound black or any color or race. Because it's like people say that, I'm just kind of like, how does that? I don't get it. Like I don't personally. Get it. <gasps> What's, what was the first console? Shayla. Super Nintendo Entertainment System. 
it sits down. Like, when I say I was gaining from birth, I legit mean it. Like, I legitimately mean it. Like, I wasn't even one yet when I started to, like, mess around with the controllers and shit. <gasps> Wow. <laughs> wow, I thought he was going to leap at you and just like slash your head off. Yeah, I thought he was too. You. He's just like straight up licked the back of her neck and she died. <laughs> she couldn't have to do his tongue game. Could you imagine doing that to a girl? Like you lick the back of her neck and she just rolls over and, and she croaks it. <laughs> it's like, it's like, what the How fuck happened? Got? I let the back of her neck. What the fuck you look at the back of her neck for, nigga? Like, we're trying to be kinky. It's like, look, man, it was... We had a couple of drinks. <laughs> we got a little bit too kinky for our own good. I licked the back of her neck. She died. I don't know what happened. All right. It's like I don't know what happened. I don't even know how the fuck I tried to fight him with a handgun anyway. I mean, I would have just ran. Honestly, I just would have got the fuck out of dodge. A tongue in the ass? Yo, if you do that, if you do that, if you do that, I can't trust you. I can't trust you. You know, you know how fucking, um, the, the Metro thing is? If Metro don't trust you, he gonna shoot you? I don't trust you. I don't, I don't want you to be shot, but I damn sure don't trust you. We ain't sharing shit. You're like, yo, dog, can I get some of that Gatorade? And we just got done, like, working out at the gym. I'm like, fuck, Dono. You eat ass. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> can you get some? <laughs> you can go over there and get you some ass. <laughs> go fucking eat some ass for your new, <laughs> for your nutrients. <laughs> get the fuck out of here. Energize yourself with some eating ass. <laughs> I'm not sharing shit with you. No, sir. No, sir at all. I like how you're just running into the wall and he just like licks you right in the neck again. God, could you imagine if liquors could latch onto your ass like they can now? In this game, that would have been terrifying. That would have been like the most terrifying thing in the world. Like he just wraps his tongue around your neck and just pulls your ass in. I wouldn't be able to handle that as a child. But um, Yeah, I've I've been gaming for a long, long time. Just thinking about it now. Yeah, but like the first console I actually fucking remember is the uh, Sega. First one, Super Nintendo. It's Super Nintendo. The good times, you know, when when we had Mario, when we had Mega Man X, or when we had Castlevania. I think I played mostly Mega Man on computer. Zombie ain't my neighbors. <laughs> Zombie ain't my neighbors is like really, really fucking bad. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Denied. <laughs> Poor zombies. All they ever wanted to do was get Claire's number, and instead they got denied. They all got denied. See, but now that I think about it, girls wore shorts like that before. But they also had something under those shorts, so their ass isn't completely out. That doesn't exist anymore. Why? 